Hey guys, it's Amir from Memos.com, and here I am in Otherland. This is, uh, I'm tr I tried to make a follow-up video to my last one, because we ended in the tutorial, and we are on Remote X X this time, because, uh, the tutorial bugged out for us. Basically, when I logged back into Remote X, Remote rather, it threw me back into the, uh, nebulous, wide-open area where I did, I ran around and talked to Orlando, and it threw me back over there with no quests and nothing to do. I, I wandered for, like, 15 minutes, and I realized, wait a minute, my character's stuck here forever, time to make a new character. So we made Remote X, and on Remote X, we, uh, we got to around the the same area, and then the game just bugged out, and it restarted, and then I could not proceed. The quest was completely broken, and there was nothing to do. So I had to make Rimote XX, who we're on right now. We got the furthest we've gotten on him. So we had to defend this, uh, defend Legolas 15 against four waves of enemies. On the second wave, uh, this guy, for some reason, has got one HP left out of 225, and I can't attack him at all. You know, left click does nothing, right click does nothing. Our weapon is equipped. We cannot hit him, so the game looks to be bugged out for the third time. Hopefully, oh, I can swing over here. Hold on, I can, I can get over here. Let me kill this guy. Let me kill this guy. Nope, the game does not want me to swing on this guy. So it looks like uh, a hard knock quest. Okay, I gotta defend this dude, but I just cannot because the game is bugged out for the third time. I really wanted to play this game, but it bugged out so far three full times, and every single time, like in the most ridiculous manner. One time, on the second time, I literally fell off the floor into an unknown. And once you log in, it just you can re-log and re-log back in, and it just, but it still just screws up. So I tried hitting the respawn button on the last uh, bug out, and it didn't fix it. Maybe on this bug out, I can fix it. We're gonna hit respawn, and we just bam, fall on the floor dead. So hopefully this will reset this quest. Well, that's fine. I haven't tried it yet, so here we are. Uh, let's let's take a look. Defend Legolas, and now we are back in a little prison cell. I guess we're waiting to heal ourselves a little bit. You can see I kind of click two to heal faster, three. Uh, no, we just kind of we can't even move right now. The game is like, you know what? You respawn, you can't move. So wait for our HP to heal a little bit. We're at 195, and it's going up slowly. And we got some dudes over there patting the ground, making making sure the ground is still there, just smacking the ground with their hands. And then there's, there's a more simuloids. I suspect the game is going to bug out again, and I will have no other recourse but to remake a fourth character. I'm sorry, guys. I am not going to make a fourth character just to get past the game's tutorial. Uh, I might make a follow-up video with the game's actually released, but for an early access title which was promised to be more complete than any other early access title out there, uh, that's what Drago Entertainment has said. They said this is a, one of the most developed early access titles out there. It is definitely a lie. Well, here we are. We can move again. Let's see. All right, where's our boy? Where's our boy? Come on! Nope. This asshole is just standing here again. Gang member with one out of twenty fifty-five HP. So yeah, this game just does not function. We just you just can't play it. I mean, you have to try multiple times and you can get past the beginning. If you match doing any first try, congrats, man. I tried four. This is my fourth legit attempt over here. So it just does not cooperate. And it looks like we have to call it because the game. Oh oh, we did it. 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 Okay, that guy just fell down dead. The game. We did it, boys. We're going. We're going! Alright, let's see how long it goes before we bug out again. I think we should be alright. So let's take a look. We're gonna kill, uh, the bad sector gang, you know. Dude, the story's very well fleshed out. These are, these are just the bad guys. Alright, let's kill these over here. And combat is actually... I'm, tr I'm playing an assassin this time, so I want to try a different class. Uh, actually, the archer was the most fluid of all the classes. For some reason, assassin feels much less fluid. It feels very, um... Combat feels very uninvolved. Your attacks feel very, just like, it just kind of And first of all, I'm not even hitting him, but I, I am, apparently. I'm facing the other direction. So we finally completed this quest. So we can talk to, uh, this is dude over here, our hard knock. So you can see, I'm not sure, we got in this prison, and these guys have, like, some dead hookers over here. I'm not sure, like, what is this? Like, is it, like, literally a stoned hooker? Is she, like, petrified? Is she getting Medusa or something? Can we, can we see up her skirt? Mm, no, we can't. We got another one over here. This is, uh, alright, right here. Interesting position for us. Can't zoom in the camera any further. But I think it's just like a statue, because they're like literally stone. <laughs> Let's go talk to this, uh, Legolas15 dude over here. Alright, uh, talk to the girl at the door. There was no girl at the door. But now there is. The door opened. So yes, we might finally finish the tutorial. It took us multiple attempts, and I, I, I think I'm able to do it. I see my timing couldn't be better. Alright, okay over here. At least it didn't zoom- oh, it didn't zoom into her butt last- this time, my character's butt, rather. Old-fashioned talking. Alright, we got a nice view right here, this is- this is perfect. Uh, my name is Renee, I'm a friend of Orlando, and it seems like he is a mutual one. So, translations aren't really great either. So, vengeance. Defeat Rozzy's gang members. So far, the story is very poorly fleshed out. I mean, for a game inspired by a book, you would expect a little bit more. But again, of course, it's early access. So let's go kill these, uh, gang members over there. They're just checking us out, you know? They're not even gonna attack us. 
They're gonna just chillax over there. How close can I get before they attack me? I can target that guy over there now. Do I have a new weapon actually? Yes, we do. Let's might as well equip that. And we got some boots, which are useless. So we're not gonna equip those. All right, let's see. These guys are pretty chill. Pretty chill gang members. I feel like a lot of the enemies just feel like completely one dimensional. Like, look at these guys. All right, they're just standing there. I, they literally stood there until I walked up to them and punched them. And these other guys are not even gonna help. Why would they? Where's my friends? Why aren't they helping? Aren't these jerks on my team? Guys, help me out over here, Sweetie Chang. All right, these guys are like, you know what? I, we aggroed way too far. You know, I'm not, I'm not used to stepping away from my home box over there. Guys, help me out here. Help me out, bros, Sweetie Chang. Come on, Sweetie, help me out. And you, let's just walk over there, dudes. I guess we gotta try to do it solo. Can we heal ourselves first? Yes, we can. I just don't want to die, so let's let's hopefully we can make this happen. So this is easily one of the buggiest games I have played. But I haven't played too many early access games, so perhaps that's why. Of course, look at me, I'm walking while sitting. Beautiful. You see the animation over there? Awesome. Right, let's kill these gang members. Of course, the other guys over there are completely chill for not helping. So let's do a right click. It does more damage, I believe. Alright. Combat feels very anti-visceral. My attacks feel so shallow. And attacks feel very slow, too. Honestly, point and click gameplay is probably preferable to what we have going on with uh, other land right now. Defeat right- oh, of course, these guys join in now after the two buddies die. They like to come in waves, you know? They want to fight the honorable way. They don't want to gank me. They're going to fight like honorable gentlemen. Alright, let's keep killing these dudes. I think I cast a buff on myself. We're going to go ahead and right click. Do a better attack. It's got a little bit of a cool ammo. Right click this more deeps, it looks like. And yeah, let's keep beating these guys up. I mean, I can hit both at once, which is kind of cool. Alright, we killed a whole bunch of these. They dropped their loots. Of course, I'm walking around like that. Let's go look at their extracting the eDNA fragments. Not sure what this does yet, but you can do it, so might as well. Right, let's kill two more gang members. I don't have to kill two more of you. I won't kill all of you guys. I can just kill two more and we're good. Awesome. Those two guys just lounging by on the ground, they're not gonna help out. They're like wounded anyway. Hopefully after this quest, I can finally get out of this tutorial. So you can see what the actual game is about. We get So not only is the, the gameplay buggy and prone to like freezing and crashing, making you making new characters in the tutorial, the combat is pretty pretty awful in my opinion. It might get better later, and there might be some interesting mechanics. I just want to get to those mechanics so we can talk about them at least. Defeat Razzie's gang leader. Wouldn't Razzie be the gang leader? Like, or Razzie, whatever his name is? I feel like that would make the most sense. But I guess... Oh god, we're too low anyway. We shouldn't have fought. We're 43 HP. And my boys aren't even helping. I, I, we just broke out of jail together. And these guys, like, they threw us in jail. And these guys are being assholes. They're not helping me out. Makes no kind of sense. Alright, we gotta, we gotta chillax till we heal up. Do some recuperating. See my inventory over here. Alright, let's see what's going on. You can see my quests, my credits, and my delicious recipes. Alright, we got some somas. We got some, uh, some, they look like eggs. Like broken eggs. See my gear. Alright, we're good to go. We're fully healed. And my asshole teammates are still not gonna help me out. Of course. So you can't pick up these things. There we go. We're getting more DNA fragments. I love me my DNA fragments. Why not? See, in the future, everybody dresses like with skin tight uniforms and then look all sci fi y. Because then they gotta know it's the future. Alright, so we'll kill this guy. Hopefully we can do this because uh, we, had a little, we took some damage earlier. But I think we should be able to kill these guys. Eh, he dies fairly quickly. 562. He's only level 5. Should be should be doable. Let's right click through some deeps. Bam. Big right click damage. So basically combat just comes down to holding down your left mouse button. You're not manually clicking for each attack. I kind of wish you did because it would make the game feel more involved. But no. You're just holding down left mouse button for the most part. Alright. This guy's going to die real soon. He's got a pretty big-ass weapon. Look at that huge, enormous weapon. Alright, we defeated Rozzy's gang leader. Which, again, doesn't make much sense. Rozzy should be Rozzy's gang leader, at least in my opinion. Help wounded simuloids. I want to open this. Let's interact with it. Why not? To bring some epics in here. I'm just glad I was able to get past that frozen part. And funny thing is, before I start recording, I've literally tried there for like over 10 minutes. And you can't attack on command either. Look at this. Look, like, there's no way to just attack on command. There might be a hockey for it somewhere, but like, I'm literally hitting all the keys. I'm like... Oh, we did something. We did something. All right, we 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 recuperated. Two does not do this Q attack automatically. Oh, these guys respawn. So we gotta kill these guys. All right, a pretty cool attack over there. Uh, these guys killing these guys will not give me anything. I have to help the wounded dudes. So these guys just kind of respawned on me. All right, we kill. I think if you fall off, you die too. But you know what? We're gonna be, we should try that. Why not? Now nah, we're not gonna try that. We're gonna kill these guys. I just wanna get past this beginning area. Hopefully, we finally can. But yeah, the gameplay is very, very iffy. Definitely wait 
So well after early release. There's no reason to pay for this game in early access. Though actually, uh, they did say they're going to launch the game with a buy-to-play model. Before it was up in the air, but now they, it looks like they settled on buy-to-play. So I think it'll be 17 bucks when it comes out. Or something around, along those lines. But if you want to play the game, and if you're a fan of Ted Williams' work, definitely wait till after early access. There's no reason to play a buggy game, or pay for a buggy game. Alright, there's a more gang. We can help these three guys right out. We got two. We got one more, and we should be good to go. Interacting with weak players. Nice. All right. You know what? I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm gonna ignore these guys beating on me. No. Can we click on this? Yes, we can. Interaction interrupted. Come on. Let's get it. Oh, fine. We gotta kill these jerks. Uh. Once you're out of combat, you can heal very quickly. It's just that when you're in combat, you just. Or, oh God. We don't. We might die. What if we jump off? Let's end the misery. No, we can't jump off over here. All right, we're gonna walk away. And these guys have like no patience. They will not chase me more than like a centimeter. So we can just, we can heal ourselves after we're out of combat. And here we go. I'm hoping after this, we're good to go. And I, I suspect we might be. Cause if, I, if, you don't, if you don't finish the tutorial in one go, if I log off right now, come back in, the game just breaks. You have to, you have to make a new character because you're back, all, you're back into the, a different area and there's nothing to do. You have to make a new character if you get stuck over here. So where are these two other weak simulators? Oh, we got one over here. We got, we got to kill these two. So these stupid guys respawn too. Kind of wish I knew about this quest before I uh, like killed the boss leader over there. Then we can do them concurrently. The game does not want that. Stab this guy. Now we can do a number two attack as well. That's a stronger attack. Pretty short cooldown anyway. We have E and Q as well for abilities. All right, we can help this guy up. You weak player, you. Just NPCs. Let's do Q. Does that attack over there? We can try our luck with some uh, E. Bam! And it just gets it. When you when you start doing cool attacks, the game does uh, get a little FPS uh, spikes, or rather FPS spikes down. Oh my god! We just aggro more dudes. Hopefully, we should be okay. If we do we do some AOE attacks, so we should. Be, I think nope. We're probably gonna we we healed anyway. How would I heal? Who knows? I think if I need a Q, I might have healed myself. All right, these guys should hopefully die. All right, combat is definitely picking up over here. I'm, 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 I, I get a lot of experience grinding off these guys because I was stuck here for a little while. All right, interacting with this one. Please let this tutorial be over. I am so done with running this multiple times. All right, let's go talk to these asshole who wouldn't help me over here earlier. Conditions, defeat his gang members, and this, we did it. Quest complete. And what I hate is when you complete the quest, you gotta talk to the same NPC again. Why couldn't you just present this quest to me anyway? It's not like I had a choice. I, I have to do this quest to leave this area. You found the portal. All right, nice. Let's go and set the said portal. Uh, leave and never return. That sounds excellent. That is my feeling towards this game right now. All right, we're going. We're going. Hey, are these guys not following? Oh, there we go. Now they would. Now they want to help. Now these assholes want to help me after they already, like killed a bunch of dudes. These jerks. All right, we're running up here. Hopefully, get our ass out of here and we are done. Go to the ramp to the portal. Go up the ramp to the portal. It should be up over here, and we should be Gucci. I mean, the only, like, so far redeeming things I like about the game are some of the visuals. And it's not really a portal, it's more like a door. But whatever, you know, I'm not going to complain. It's just the door. Use a portal to get to Lambda Mall. Lambda? That sounds familiar. It's from a Tales game. I think Tales of Graces F. Lambda. Rings the bell. Not sure what it was in Tales of Graces, but it was a thing. I think it was the name of the... I haven't played Tales of Graces F in forever. All right, so it looks like... Are we... Are we the game is done? Do we freeze? Are we Gucci? Are we done? I mean, the game is still says it's recording. Look at the top left. My FPS is going up and down. And it looks like we have to we have to restart again. Another excellent... This is a perfect time to end this video, right? Another another wonderful bug out. And I'm, I can't do anything. Unknown error. Bottom left. Well, guys, that has been Otherland. I can't imagine I'm the only one having trouble with the game because, again, it, I've already... Third try is a charm. And we just got our fourth mess up over here. Uh, hopefully, like if I just log off and log back on it won't be a disaster let's find out you know what let's see let's see where this goes because clearly i was stuck over there let's log out and log back in if it throws me into like a place where i'm permanently stuck i'm gonna i'm uninstalling this game asap in queue so again for a game that's been developed since 2008 or at least that's when they began development you'd expect a little bit more all right get on over here make character list Okay, these two characters are permanently stuck in place. Like this, look, look, this character is just stuck. I can't even play him. So let's check out Remote X. Hopefully, oh, it says I'm in Land of All, so it's good. It got me. It got me through the portal, through the error. Had I not gone through that portal, had I been stuck where I was, the game would have been completely broken. Because once you're past an area and you get thrown back in there, the quests just don't work and you're stuck there. 
So I should be okay. Oh, we're good. We're back in the hidden bat. We're now we're in the hidden bat sector. All right. Uh, wait, no. This part was earlier. Beautiful purple map. This is, this is what I need. All right. Uh, use a portal to get the land them all. This hopefully should work. F. Yes. Yes. We're doing it. We're doing it. And, and, do we got it? Please, internet, please. Other, other land plucks. Uh, looks like, looks like the game is stuck again, guys. Cannot even play. But yes, that is the perils of early access. I mean, I should not have paid 16 bucks for this game. It was most certainly not worth. But hopefully, they, they fixed it. Right now, very sad state of the game. I, I say skip this one for sure. And if you really like sci-fi, you really like Ted Williams' work, then maybe check it out on release. Right now, definitely avoid. Anyway, guys, if you guys want to play other land or just learn more about it, do check the full review on Inmos.com on the link below. Anyway, guys, later.